Critics say that the transport of goods by road damages the environment because of the high levels of pollution and high fuel consumption. Researchers in Sweden are testing a technology to reduce these effects. If the tests are favourable, it could change the way lorries use our roads. The Swedes are testing intelligent vehicles which go along roads like a sort of train, forming convoys of evenly spaced vehicles in a chain. There are experiments with cars underway using a similar technology. The trucks are able to communicate between each other and automatically find their position on the road. The objective is that several trucks could line up behind each other, just like skiers or cyclists do to reduce air friction. This could save as much as 10% of fuel costs. There'll be a space to get in between the trucks. We're considering gaps of between 15 to 25 meters. So you'll be able to get in between and you'll be able to pass if you're going fast enough. The system will sense the approaching car and slow down to make the gap a little bigger. The computers control all the pedals and trucks can steer themselves. So what will the drivers do? Like pilots with autopilots, they'll still supervise and maintain control of the system. So wouldn't it be simpler just to use trains? Experts answer they've taken the advantages of trains and moved them out onto the roads. The train's very good for some types of transport, but it's not very flexible. Very long trains take a long time to load and unload. Here trucks can join and leave the caravan while it's still moving along the motorway. These vehicles, according to researchers, are entering the final stages of development and could already be operational next year on Swedish highways.